Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. And today we have the X Max here with the X Max Wide Kit. That's right, guys. We're going to go ahead and throw the X Max Wide Kit here on the X Max. We did pick up the green color. This one was on back order, but it's back in stock. I uh, got mine from Traxxas.com. These are the different colors you can get you can get black, green, red, orange, and blue. I was really impressed with. Uh, the wide kit on the Max, guys, it runs so much better in my opinion. I'm glad I did it. The X-Max and the Max are two different trucks, guys. The Max is just a shrunk down version here of the X-Max. But the X-Max is a lot heavier than the uh, Max. It does handle differently in my opinion, especially into turns. The X-Max is not really going to traction roll as much. It's just so heavy. Uh, the X-Max leans more into turns. With that being said, I'm not so sure this is a necessary upgrade or that it's needed for the X-Max like it was with the Max, in my opinion. Because like I said, it does handle differently. So with that being said, guys, I wanted to go ahead and unbox the uh, kit. But you got your instructions here. And this kit comes just like the Max kit. The Max kit doesn't really show you how to do the install. This is just for the shocks for some reason. I guess if maybe you need to tune the shocks after you do the upgrade I'm not sure we're going to be needing this all right guys so this is what you get in the kit you get your upper and lower a arms you get your axles here or drive shafts dog bones whatever you want to call them this is uh my major concern with this upgrade guys these do feel very tough very strong but when you start going longer with your drive shafts, they're more liable to bend or break on hard landings. So hopefully that's not the case with these. Hopefully these hold up. We've got our steering links here. And it looks like we got four uh, shocks instead of two that came in the uh, Max kit. We're going to go ahead and start with the install. And we'll see how the X-Max wide kit improves performance. Let's get it. footprint with the uh, wider suspension so we are more stable again the x-max in my opinion handled pretty well to be so big of a truck uh, it looks cool with the uh, suspension there I like it goes really well with the green body still got Willie's on command that's always good go ahead and take her off road Now guys, I did have to adjust the shocks a little bit, especially there in the rear. Uh, it was kind of sagging in the rear end there. So we did adjust the shocks. Installation went pretty uh, well without a hitch. Took a little bit longer than the uh, Max install because we got a lot more screws those a-arms and stuff that are holding those pins in but it wasn't too bad i took the time to uh clean the truck up while we had her apart 
And I suggest you guys, if you install the wide kit here on the X-Max, that you do the same thing. Uh, use that time to uh, clean your shocks and uh, clean your truck up. Mine was pretty dirty. <laughs> but it handles, I'm not gonna say a whole lot better. It's not as dramatic as an improvement as it was on the Max because the Max really did need a wide kit, guys. The Max uh, traction rolled quite a bit. I can't say the same thing here for the uh, X-Max. The X-Max didn't really traction roll as much. It's a lot bigger uh, of a truck and uh, a lot heavier, so it tends to lean into turns. So we never really ran into that issue. Do I think it's a, a much needed upgrade? Like, do you really need this uh, for the X-Max? I say no, not really necessary. Like I said, the X-Max handles pretty good because of its size and weight. It's not really necessary for this upgrade, but it is pretty cool to have. It gives the truck a cool new look. And I can't say that it hurts uh, performance in any way. It does handle well, but it's, like I said, it's always handled well in the beginning, so. I don't think it's a necessary upgrade, you know, to get it running the way you want it to, but I'm glad I did it. guys i say if you're on the fence with the uh, x max wide kit i say go out and get it it is a cool upgrade and with the colors it kind of pops with the body so i like the way it looks in that aspect it does land jumps uh better obviously because of the wider footprint because we have the uh wider suspension the x max in my opinion always handled pretty good uh especially considering the size of this truck and the weight of the truck uh, is it something that you really, really need to get your X-Max running right? Probably not. Uh, but I'm glad I got it. I'm glad I installed it. It does run better with it. Uh, but it's not like the same situation like it was with the uh, Max. The X-Max doesn't really traction roll as much as the X-Max did stock. So it's not. you're not going to see a dramatic, dramatic improvement. Does it improve handling overall? Yes, I say it does. All right, guys. Well, that's all I got for this video. I appreciate you watching. If you like what we do here on the channel, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps me out. This is RC Reviews signing out, and I will see you guys next time.